Welcome back to the Gold Spartan and the moment we've all been waiting for, the uh, the new Investor Crate box has arrived. I've been excited about this one for two reasons. First reason is I tried a new crate. I did the Constitutional Crate uh, for $100 to, um, to see what, what that was all about with, uh, with Investor Crate. It was a brand new crate. Um, and then I did a $200 gold crate. Um, I've done that once before. I got a five gram gold bar. Um, we'll see what uh, what comes in the mail this time. So let me go ahead and uh, start opening this up. I have not uh, looked at any of this. Like I said, I'm literally cutting the bag open now. Uh, so this will be a surprise to all of us. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to get this, but uh, they said that the first um, hundred, I think, people who did this got a copy of the Constitution, uh, which was kind of cool. So I didn't, I didn't uh, do it for that reason, but I will take it. So thank you, Investor Crate, for uh, for that little addition. Um, as always, these come in the same box. Um, as always, and let's go ahead. And so even though I have, I, I got two crates, right? I did two orders, $100 um, constitutional silver and the uh, $200 gold crate. It still comes in the same box, and that's a good thing so that we save on shipping. Um, all right, so I know we're uh, pretty close here. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, just pull some of this stuff out and I'll show it to you as I, as I get it. Um, I'm gonna start with the constitutional silver. And so I just pulled some gold out. Uh, but I'm gonna wait till we get to the end for that part of it. All right, this is pretty cool already. Um, making sure so this is the constitutional silver that I got. Um, so we've got some mercury dimes. I've, it, I'm happy I got these. Uh, I've, I've been collecting these actually lately. Um, so some of the only uh, silver that I constitutional silver that I've been collecting. So we've got 1942, 1920, 1935. Um, 1945, 1944, 1942, 1936, and a 1943. So in total, that is eight, I believe. So eight uh, mercuries, mercury dimes. We've got some of the standing liberty. So these are the quarters. Um, 1926, 1920, 1926, that one's hard to tell, 1927, looks like 1926, but I could be wrong on that one, and 1926. So overall, pretty solid. Um, this is... Um, most of the dates were readable, which is the important part usually for these. Um, and it looks like uh, $1.75 in face value there. And then last but not least for the constitutional silver, we got a good little mix here. So um, a, a Walking Liberty, half dollar, 1939. We've got a 1942, we've got a 1941, 1943, we've got a Franklin 1951, Franklin, and two Roosevelt's, um, 19, both 1964. So uh, pretty cool. Um, so let's see, one, two, three, so four dollars there. Um, five seventy five plus ninety. I'll let y'all do the math on that. Uh, but that's what I got for the hundred dollar 
um, crate from that part of it. Make sure there's nothing else that I missed in the uh, that part. Okay, so that's the uh, the silver part. So let's go over the gold. So I did a $200 gold crate. And what I ended up getting was this, uh, let's see, 2019 one tenth gold eagle. I do like some gold eagles. Um, so I'll definitely take that. And then looks like we got a PAMP one gram um, bar. And so, um, you know, in general, when, when we when we break this down, um, I would have to calculate on on these um, as far as what the face value um, was compared to what I got. Um, let's see. Let me see if I can do that real quick. Four. So it looks like six fifty five, six dollars and fifty five cents in face value. Um, paid a hundred bucks, so that's going to be a little bit more than what I probably would pay somewhere else. Um, again, it's a brand new box, so um, you know we'll see, uh, you know how how that changes over time. But um, but for the gold, you know normally you'll you'll pay about one hundred and fifty bucks for a gold eagle. Um, and then for a gram of gold, um, you know, right now, just spot price is probably 43 bucks or so. Uh, so if we say 150 and 50, which is, I think, both fair, uh, that puts us right at that $200 mark. So pretty happy with the, uh, with the gold option. Um, and I got some variety and then, uh, and then got, again, got some more collection, uh, for my, um, for my constitutional silver. So, um, we'll see what I do next week or sorry, next month. Um, I don't know if I'll do as much as I did this month, but, uh, I might try maybe the silver bar option or, um, I might just go all in on gold again. We'll see. Uh, if you liked these, um, if you like this video, I do this once a month, uh, when the investor crate box comes in, um, you can go back and watch my previous, uh, investor crate opening, um, and see what I got in that in that box. Uh, I also do Tuesdays uh, at the coin shop where I go every Tuesday and uh, basically just go buy a bunch of stuff from from my local shop. Uh, and I turn around and I end up selling most of that on Facebook and Instagram. So make sure you check me out there. Um, but overall, make sure you uh, subscribe to this uh, this channel. Make sure you follow me on Instagram, which is uh, the Gold Spartan Twenty Three. Um, check out my Facebook page. All that information will be in the comments below. And let me know what you think about, uh, about Investor Crate. Um, I personally enjoy it. I like the variety. I, I like seeing what I get every week, or sorry, every month. But, um, but let me know what you think. And uh, hopefully we'll talk to you soon.